the Asia Pacific Academy of Ophthalmology this week, we wanted to welcome you with traditional Malaysian hospitality. That's why I'm wearing this batik inspired jacket. And that's why I'm all the way up here in KL Tower, a historic spot with amazing views of the city. It's crystal clear that in 20 years, final programs like the APAOs have changed dramatically. I'm talking great talks on lenticle extraction now, AI, fakic lenses, and a whole lot more. You know, 20 years ago, there was barely a word on young ophthalmologists or women in ophthalmology, yet now they're all the rage. What do you think about that, Chris? Yeah, man, that's great. Uh, 2023 really gives us a chance to connect and collaborate with industry and the community and rebuild for the future. That's right, Chris. Well, four years ago was the last APAO Physical Congress in Bangkok. We're reconnecting here in KL and it's gonna be great. There's over 3,000 delegates from our old corners of the globe. That's right, Chris. There's four days of symposium, workshops, wet labs, exhibition, social programs, and a whole lot more. There's a real buzz and excitement in the community here. So don't look down. I mean, don't miss out. Well, I don't know about you, Matt, but I'm happy to be back on the ground. Well, we are on the ground here covering the APAO as its official media partner. That's right. We'll be coming at you every day with four show dailies. Cake and Pie magazine. My TV interviews and roundups. In fact, we've got a whole Mice TV studio right at our booth. And we'll be helping to connect industry with top KOLs. Chris, this is just the start. We're gonna be covering 36 shows worldwide. That's right, Matt. So whether you're here with us in Kuala Lumpur or somewhere else in the world, make sure to tune in and follow our conference coverage.